Hi, today I'm going to show you how to make population pyramids using Google Sheets. It's really easy. All you have to do is follow these simple steps. First thing is you have to have good data. Uh, what I do is I have the data, the age cohorts, uh, going backwards from 70 uh, and up, down all the way to 0 to 4. Then you have the males and the females. You want to have the male population with a negative number, even though it isn't and the females with a positive number. That's so that you can put the, the, two, the cohorts, the male and female, on opposite side of a central axis. Now, to do the graph, you simply click on Canada, drive it across, you let go, insert, chart. Now you've got a population pyramid, but we need to do a few things. One of the things, uh, most important things we need to do is make sure that the uh, that the x-axis is even. And to do that, we put a negative 10 and a positive 10, so that when we compare it to other population pyramids, we have a consistent, uh, consistent scale. So we click on Customize. We're going to go to Horizontal Axis. We change it to negative 10 and positive 10. Now we're going to change the titles, chart title, and we're going to name what this data belongs to. So Canada, and this is 2016. Then we're going to change, put a subtitle, and we're going to put by your name on the date. And it, you're done. So the next thing that you need to do is you're going to copy it, copy the chart, and use it where you need to. Another thing you can do is you can make it uh, three-dimensional. So you can go in style, and you can make uh, put it into 3D. That's it. It's fairly simple. And you can do that without any sort of population pyramid data.